really want to know. So I moved from Puerto Rico, um, and I came. I went to you know school in Boston, and then my mom bought a house in Brooklyn. And she was like, "All right, you're going to high school. Like this is it." I was like, "Oh boy!" You know, I was like, "All right, I barely knew English, and I was like, these are all new friends." I was scared, wasn't even the word. Nervous, wasn't even the word. Anxious, wasn't even the word. But I came, and I was like, "All right." I remember sitting in these seats on freshman first night, and my mom was already mad. She was like, I'm hungry, I'm gonna go home. And I keep talking, I'm like, I know, Ma, I'm sorry, I'm gonna go home. And I was like, all these kids are talking about, oh, you, you have to be here, and then lunch starts at this time, and teachers are here, and I was like, oh my goodness, like, I'm petrified. And it's nothing to be scared about. High school is, it goes by so fast, but it's something you'll never forget. The memories you make here are incredible, and I was just kind of going through my first couple years of high school, just kind of like, just making it. I had some friends, I joined the wrestling team, so I was like, I'm part of the team, I'm, I'm kind of part of the school community, that kind of exists, people kind of know me. And I was like, well, why is it high school, like high school musical, why isn't it this great thing that people made it out to me? You know, like, where's, where's the music, where's the one skipping down the hallways, but I'm like, where's that, where is it? And it wasn't there. And I didn't know what I was going to need to get me there. I didn't know if it was joining a club. I didn't know if it was doing another sport or spending more time here. But I was like, why is it high school what like, everyone said it was going to be? And I was, I was taking an uh, AP Lane test when my teacher told me, he's like, oh, there's this summer reading SmackDown. And I want you to do it. There's this book. I know you read it. I know you liked it. I know how passionate you were about it. He's like, I need you to argue for it. He was like, you're the only chance I have of like, it getting through. And I was like, okay, when's the snack time? He was like, it's tomorrow. And I was like, it's tomorrow. <laughs> wow, you know, you're one day to do this? These kids have had two weeks like, or not more time to, to write what they're going to say about the book. And I was like, I have overnight. I'll talk about the homework after, but I was like, it's crazy. But I was like, all right, I'm going to do it. I didn't even write down anything. I just got there and I was like, I'm going to take a deep breath and I'm going to give this speech about this book and why I should win. Long story short, I won. And it's how the summer reading book all reading.
nothing to lose sleep about. It's nothing to to really like get worked up about because it's gonna be okay. We're all here to help you. We're all here to 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 make this experience that much more better. To make it high school musical. To make it everything you thought it was gonna be. And the only way to do that is to get out there. If you're comfortable, you're doing high school wrong. If if you're just all right, I'm going to school. I'm going to homework. I'm going to do my homework. When I get home, then I'm going to bed. I'm not out. You don't have to go home. Stay here. Talk to your teacher after school. How you doing? How you stay? <laughs> you know, I like stay after school and just getting involved has changed my world for for the better. Just because I argue for a book, I'm not an intern at the state house. I now have friends in high places, and Lord only knows where I'm going to go after college and after high school. You know, so it's it's really just getting out there and just being uncomfortable, putting yourself in situations where you're like, I don't know if I can do this, but I'm gonna give it 110 percent, and that's all that matters, and that's all that's gonna get you forward and hopefully get to that next level. So, if there's any advice I can give to you freshmen here tonight, or anyone who's new to the school, is get out there, be uncomfortable, be nervous, be a mess, but just give it 110 percent, give it everything you got, no matter what. Thank you so much.